Here comes Johnny McIntyre, the man who lost the championship in the last race, the last virtually the last corner of last season. He was chasing three in a row. He's got a lot to prove. So far, he set the pace right throughout today, Mark. And if anyone can put the perfect lap together, I'd have to put my money on Johnny Mack. Well, he is the only man that can now deny Eddie Bell his first ever pole position in the NZV8s. Johnny Mack knows how to do it. He proved he could do it at Bathurst in the Stone Brothers cars. Let's see what he delivers. Yes, it's been a, a big off-season, if you call it that, for Johnny Mack. And uh, there's some fantastic cameras on board his Falcon. And, and one of them were looking just as he walked up earlier. You probably see it as we go around here looks like he's using some left foot braking. Just for the initial warm up part, I doubt he'd be doing that in the race, but you'll see it hitting the kerb there, right over hard this one here. Okay, coming onto the back straight, every ounce of kerb, letting it flow. This is a very, very fast lap. Great view there, you can actually see how early he's trying to get on the power, how sideways this Falcon is getting. It is, it, this is the hardest thing being a racing driver is trying to take your time getting the power down, but sometimes the slower you are, the faster you are. But have you lot ever been patient? OK, here we come down to braking. Look at the front of the car squat will go down under the braking. Far less aggressive camber setup it looks like compared to Sandy Knight. And I, I don't know, I, these cars, it just doesn't look right when you've got massive amounts on the front, nothing on the back with that old card axle. That's correct. What these guys do, they actually have a special qualifying oil as well. So they drain all the engine oil out, put lightweight oil in. It's only designed to do five or ten laps. Tonight they take it out, but every ounce of kerb, he's throwing everything he possibly can at it. See how hard Johnny Mack was working, was it enough? Yes it was, a 1.027, a very, very quick lap, he takes it, he's on pole for the first race of the season, Johnny Mack.